Hello everybody and welcome to the second part. Here we have our croutons, chicken breast meat and onions all grinded. And like I said in the first part that uh, we add croutons and they already been seasoned. So we're not going to put too much of the seasoning here. The only um, seasoning we're going to put is this garlic salt and we have over here two tablespoons of garlic salt and vegetable seasoning, um, two tablespoons of that and we're going to add this all in here. It might seem too much but it's not because we have a lot of uh, meat in here. The next ingredient we're going to add is is water we have here about two cups of water so the reason we add in the water is because when you fry them they come out soft and juicy and they're not really hard and not really dry that's the reason we add water and onions and also we have here about four tablespoons of mayo and this is the other reason why we have to add mayo because it makes the meatballs really juicy and soft and not really dry. So if you want to enjoy juicy meatballs and not dry, then you have to add uh, water, mayo, onions. All these ingredients make the meatballs turn out juicy and, and soft. So we're going to add this mayo in here and we're gonna mix them all together okay so our meatballs are ready to be fried and uh, we can add a little bit more water because uh, chicken breast meat it tends to be a little more on the harder side so we added more water to make sure they come out softer so here we have our skillet ready with oil and also our pan with some paper towels that way it drains all the excessive oil from the meatballs and we are ready to get those meatballs into the skillet okay so these meatballs we have to make them in hand that way we can press it down and you can try with a spoon but i would recommend using both hands to make a shape and to press them a little bit down and we Fry them on both sides, probably two minutes each, depending how quick um, you keep your heat on and how quick they gonna fry. That's depending on the heat um, that you fry them on. So let's do the frying. So here's our meatballs. He's already been fried and here you can see that it came out really soft and I would say there's really no difference between uh, if you use chicken tenders or chicken breast meat it comes out both the same if you use the right amount of ingredients and those three main or three secret things that I told you to add which is water, mayo and onions which makes them really delicious and juicy and soft and that's how they turned out. So thank you everybody for staying up to date on my channel. Please subscribe if you haven't and share with your friends and family and hope you guys enjoy it. Thank you.